I want to talk about repetitive lying. It came to my mind and I want to speak about it. You may be dating and let me say this, you should not be fornicating. A person may, the woman or, um, or the man, I am not speaking about misunderstandings because I believe misunderstandings are going to happen. What I am going to talk about is something that person knows is unacceptable. Rather, whether they are doing it to be vindictive, rude, mean, or whatever else, like I am speaking about that. So let's say you are dating and the man or the woman does something really bad they know they should not do. And let's say they ask for forgiveness, which we have to forgive. And they want you to stay in the relationship. And let's say something else like that happens again. And they want you to stay in a relationship. Let's say this cycle happens so often. Now, if you are wise, or maybe I should say you should probably wise up and really evaluate if this relationship is really worth being in. Not speaking about misunderstandings, not speaking about misinterpretations, I am speaking about, you know, and the other person that is doing wrong knows what that person is doing is wrong. I believe there are some people that are manipulators in a bad way that will lie to you, lie to you to get what they want or to have some type of control or some type of bad advantage over you. I think we have to recognize these type of people like, hey, you keep apologizing, but you are steadily doing the same things over and over. So are your apologies valid? I have to forgive, yes, but I believe forgiveness and allowing you back in my life is two different things. I truly believe it. Because if you are going to continue hurting a person, I think something has to happen to where we have to separate. There is a person I know, and let me speak about one of their family members. So let me call the person I know, person A, and the family member, member, Person B. Person B is very aggressive, very rude, manipulative, a liar, and probably some other things. For whatever reason, and there is no good reason, person B likes to beat on person A. 
once person B gets into trouble, person B apologizes. Asking this, asking that. And once that person gets out of trouble, person B continues to repeat this cycle over and over again with person A. I would, I would call person B as a predator. As a, like, person A have to realize, which I believe person A does realize, the relationship, the family relationship for now, I guess, can't be mended. Obviously, there is something wrong with person B. Person B can say, I'm sorry, this will never happen again. Give me one more chance. Forgive me, blah, 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 blah. Whatever that person is saying, is it really valid? Is it? I believe there have to be a point of time, there will have to be, did I say that right? I believe there will have to be a point in time to where you leave that person alone. Repetitive lying, I would say. I would say that. I believe there are very manipulative people that probably mean you no good, that is probably waiting for your downfall or probably trying to suppress you. You may think, well, that person is my family member and since that person is family, there is no way that person wants me to fail. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? Probably some family members are worse than random enemies. I believe in some cases. Learn to cut off people, some people, not everyone, depends on the situation. And I am not speaking about family. I mean, I am not speaking about misunderstandings. I am speaking about that person definitely, definitely knows what they are doing is wrong. You know what they are doing is wrong, but they may, but they may do it because of spite, anger, hatred, or whatever else like that. I am speaking about that being vindictive. Learn to cut these people away. Because if they are saying, I'm sorry, it is never going to happen again. Give me one more chance. You know, stuff like that. But it continues to happen. When are you going to let them go? They are probably manipulating you, using you, molding you. Yes, they are probably trying to mold you into something you don't want to be, but because of their aggression, they are probably pushing you, probably because of their aggression, they are probably molding you into someone you don't want to be, but you are probably becoming it. Learn to cut some people away. 
learn to stay away from some people. Some people don't have your best interests in mind. And I believe that includes family members, associates, whomever. Let me stop here. God bless you.